What is up guys, Mac of Speed coming at ya. Great episode online for you today featuring the AEA Challenger Big 9 from Terry Fox at Fox Air Power. Today we're gonna be showcasing a brand new kind of ammunition to this channel, the Flanagan's Precision Air Ammo Rangers. Now when you look at the Ranger, you see a very simple, time-tested design. Single drive band, 357 in diameter, flat base, round nose. This is a very traditional looking projectile on par with the traditional normal shape bullet that you would typically see. Oftentimes, simplicity is overlooked, but simplicity can be highly effective just based on covering all the fundamentals. When you've got the right weight, the right shape, the right ballistic coefficient, and the right aerodynamics, chances are you're gonna eliminate a lot of variables that other lower quality ammunitions might have. I do have this big badass Challenger 9mm magazine 100% filled up with those Flanagan Rangers, and we're ready to get right into it at 25 yards and see what we're hitting. I haven't shot this thing in over four weeks now. It's been four plus weeks since I've been to the range. So I'm excited to see exactly where we hit on target, as well as where our energy falls as well. Let's get right into it. Center of target, right hand side, fire. So much more recoil than my 30 caliber Challenger. This thing has a bark to it. 1,044 feet per second. Your energy is going to be right here. One thousand five feet per second, making a baby itty bitty size group out there. I do like what I see so far. Nine seven six with a slightly different point of impact. Interesting. Kind of difficult to load that round. Nine zero six velocity. I'm interested to see where exactly this is going to go ahead and level out. We started this filming segment at about 4100 psi, which is the absolute ragged maximum that my Yang Hang can consistently put out at this point. I'm gonna go ahead and get through this five round group real quick and then check our pressure and potentially move it out to the 50 yard mark. Eight, nine, four. So pretty consistent, but still dropping incrementally with each shot. I think the best thing for us to do in this case is gonna be to go ahead and top this thing back up to a hopefully nominal fill and head out to that 50 yard mark. I do have some other episodes to film for you guys today, so I don't want to use all that I have in this baby pony tank, but I am going to pop it right back up to that 200 bar level. All right, guys, I think we're going to go ahead and try and hit this target right here. We're going to go ahead and send them right here this time. <sighs> Moving the wheel to 50. Cocking the rifle. And fire. One inch right of point of aim, not bad. Sure, footage will tell. Hits. And just dropping the thunder on them. Hits, I like it. Dude, the slug game has been gratifying all day long today. Ah, out of 
out of ammo. This is too much fun to stop now. I'm gonna go ahead and load up another mag of Rangers and just run this thing till it quits working. Not bad, dude. For plain Jane McGillicuddy bullets, these are like pretty impressive. Um, well, they're all over the ground now, but they're 125 grades. <laughs> all right. Okay, we spilled all our ammo and uh, we have our mag loaded up and we're ready to continue. Let's go. What? Seriously? After all that, it's all gonna fall over on me? Damn. I'm gonna go set that thing back up. Okay, that camera's still running. Here we go. Do I have a round loaded? Probably not. Nope. Ready. Give ourselves a clean slate. Move one row up and one row to the left. Good shot. Fucking good shots. might be starting to fall off in velocity. I'm gonna hold it over a little. Tons of hammer spring being heard. And it makes a funny noise. Let's go ahead and inspect our pressure. And um, I'm currently at 55 bar right now. So I think that's gonna be the point where we go ahead and call it on this one. Honestly though guys, nothing brings a smile to my face like this other than true success with the slug game at the range at 50 plus yards. This rifle has serious potential, absolutely outweighing my own skill set. I think this is gonna be a great place to go ahead and end today's episode. But if you like today's episode, give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more content like this, make sure you subscribe for more with that notifications button so that you can stay current on the channel as well as when new videos come out. If you really like this video, make sure you share it so that somebody else can see it. And I'll catch you boys in the next one.